Yeah, I think it was Bill Whittle. But the vast right. majority of people, um, uh, they don't even want to think. Like thinking is a threat to them. Thinking is a challenge to them. Thinking is something that they run the ops. Thinking is a predator to their brittle house of cards set of inherited or indoctrinated mere opinions. And so the idea that we would subjugate the contents of our brain to facts, reason, evidence, and reality is anathema to a majority of people in the West. And, um, you know, how hard is it to win a sword fight with a blind man? Well, <laughs> not, not that hard if, you know, he just, just suddenly wrapped something around his eyes and hasn't practiced. So, yeah, you can blind yourself. You can reject reality. You can reject truth. Truth. You can reject reason. You can join the mob and you can hunt down the rational people in your society and take them to task and, and call them out and set fire to them in pyres and all that. And all that means is that your society is doomed. That's all. I mean, that's all that means. And you, you can give up on reality, but that doesn't mean that reality is going to change to your whims. So uh, that, of course, is um, the price that we pay for, I don't know, a couple of hundred years of irrational philosophy uh, that has uh, subjugated the individual to the group, the uh, reality to subjectivism, uh, facts to feelings, and um, we're now rudderless in a high wind.